Tim, do you find streaming fun or not? When I go through life, right? I am not I'm not busy with whether I have fun or not. So when you tell me do you have fun when you stream or not? I literally have to put some time to reflect about how I feel about streaming. But that's not even what drives me. Like honestly, like if I would talk to a clone of myself, I wouldn't even I wouldn't even say, hey, how are you doing? Are you doing fine? Like, it's so, it's, it's such a, it, it, it means nothing to me. Like, fun, no fun, whatever, who gives a shit? I just got to get shit done. Uh, that aside, so, do I find stream fun? Uh, there is times where it's more enjoyable. There is times where it's less enjoyable. Uh, there's time when it's more hype, time when it's less hype. Um, but overall, streaming... Well, it just depends, depends. But you had fun in Ultima Online. Yeah, I had fun in Ultima Online. That was back in the days. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. During the Ultima Online days, I had really fun, yeah. If your question is put this way, do you think streaming is beneficial for your productivity on the game? Yes. Else I wouldn't stream. It's not like, it's not like that uh, streaming is beneficial for the game. Streaming is beneficial, well, for, for whatever we do. Charmaine Diosa says, I think that you have that mindset because of your genes. I don't think people have a choice to just not care about fun or feeling good. I thought a lot about it. Maybe you think you make a choice to not care about it, but I think it's fundamentally already like that in your brain and it's not your choice. I don't really agree with that, Charmaine. That's actually not true at all. And I've said it already many times and I've said it over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. Um... If you are being put in a concentration camp, right, and your rights are being stripped away, you can be even more hardcore than me. It has nothing to do with genes. Like, literally nothing. When you talk about genes or whatever, right, you're desperately trying to find an excuse to justify doing jack shit. Because when you tell me, like, do I experience pain? Do I experience stress? Do I experience joy? Damn straight I do. I am a human just like you. And you might say, like, yeah, but then why do you go through suffering? Because it's, it's the right thing to do. If there's people that are starving or struggling and these people could be me, it's not right for me to live a privileged life. If I would be a better person when my rights are stripped away and I'm forced, you know, to do whatever, then I don't deserve my freedoms. If I can be a better person when you take away all my rights, then I don't deserve, then I don't deserve them because I'm a better person without them. I have to live up to the version of myself that is struggling and suffering 
no fucking reason. And by doing so, I'm actually helping these people in these positions. It just comes from a truly, it, 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 it just comes from a place of honesty, just I don't lie to myself. I don't bullshit myself. Uh, shit is going bad in the world and I try to do something about it. This has nothing to do with genes. It's actually insulting to say that. Really insulting. It's like, uh, it's really like, uh, yeah, uh, y yeah, you're a robot, right? No, I'm not. I'm not at all. And, um, I fight hard. Because it's the right thing. There's people that fight hard because they have no choice. Um, but if you're honest with yourself, you can achieve the same mindset with a choice. Look at what's happening in Ukraine. In Ukraine, there's literally people dying right now people that you know have their uh, toes removed because of frostbite uh well now it's getting better weather but that happened uh a month ago or two while uh three months ago they were just living their life a lot of them might just be playing video games being potatoes full on now they gotta you know take a rifle and go around and and protect themselves and um if I would come to you and say to, you know, risk your life or whatever, you would be like, no fucking way. Like, it's not my genes why I fight uh, the fight. It's because I know it's the right thing to do. I know it's the honest thing to do. And that's it. So. Yeah. That's all I want to say pretty much. I understand, didn't want to insult you. The problem is I think that no one is forcing me to eat healthy, for example. I don't know how I can force myself without that external pressure. Stop making bullshit excuses. Stop lying to yourself. That's a nice start. Hold yourself accountable. Be a responsible human being. Growing up, grow up, mature. Become an adult. What about all of that? You're probably still living with your mama and your puppy. Well, maybe live by yourself. Experience life when uh, you are responsible for yourself. And then a lot of this shit, you know, reality knocks on your door. What do your parents want from you? They want you to be able to be independent because they ain't going to be around all the time. My parents, like, my father, back in the days, he kept saying this over and over again. You got to be on your own suite because I'm not going to be there all the time. It's true. So like you got to, you got to grow up that, that for yourself. And on top of that, if you want, you know, if you want a, a, a good relationship, a good partner, right? Y you need to be responsible. If you're not responsible, what, 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 what are you going to be? Like, there, like, uh, if you want, um, as a guy, if you want a woman, a woman wants someone that, you know, that, that, that knows what he wants, wants uh, someone that, you know, uh, is responsible, is accountable, provides a level of safety. Like, else, you know, you, you are, you're, if you don't provide as a guy, then where does your value come from? Of course, you have the value that comes from a human being unconditionally, but that, that applies to everyone. Why you? Instead of, you know, Mr. Chad over the street. Why? Because you provide and you hold yourself accountable. You're, you're a spent, you, you represent the masculine uh, properties of your human being. So when you're just sitting as a potato and doing jack shit, you're just being a child. That's not how society works. So when you say like, yeah, someone has to force me to do to eat healthy. No, it's that you're not growing up. 
you're still a mommy and a poppy boy. That's the hard truth. So stand up and, and get your shit together, yo. That's, that's, that's what you gotta do. Instead of making bullshit excuses. You, you, you know, you, it's, it, it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't get any, it doesn't get any better. So yeah, maybe that's a bit hard, but that is what it is.